is the largest developing country in the world and the second largest global economy. Through the Belt and Road Initiative, China actively promotes international cooperation and development, providing medical assistance to various countries, fostering global health collaboration and shared well-being, and jointly building mutually beneficial and win-win partnerships. By 2024, China's dispatch of medical teams for foreign aid has completed its 60th anniversary. Over the past 60 years, China has dispatched 30,000 medical team members to 76 countries and regions, saving countless lives, significantly improving the medical technology level in recipient countries, training over 100,000 medical staff and leaving behind a medical team that cannot be taken away. Chongqing has been dispatching medical teams for 22 years. Over the past years, Chongqing has successfully sent six medical teams to Barbados with a total of 53 members. The work of the medical team abroad has won high recognition and appreciation from the Barbados government and the people. In July this year, Barbados President Sandra Mason wrote in a letter of thanks to the medical team. On behalf of the government and the people of Barbados, I wish to express my sincere thanks to all of you for the professional commitment to your duties. Chongqing is the only direct administered municipality in the central and western regions of China. It is positioned to embrace a new development stage, implement a fresh development concept, and integrate into a new development framework. With its focus on the roles assigned by the nation, such as being a key national central city, an economic hub in the upper Yangtze River region, a hub for scientific and technological innovation, a new highland for reform and opening up, and a high-quality livable area. The international landscape of the two rivers and four river banks is increasingly prominent, and the reputation of a city with cultural appeal and a land of natural beauty is spreading far and wide. More and more people are coming to Chongqing to experience the charm of journey to new accomplishments. The seventh batch of the China medical team to Barbados consists of eight healthcare professionals. All team members are from large comprehensive hospitals in Chongqing city. Among them, there are three with senior professional titles and five with intermediate professional titles. They specialize in various fields, including ultrasonic medicine, nuclear medicine, vascular surgery, anesthesiology, neonatal nursing, traditional Chinese medicine, and nephrology. Associate professors Ao Meng, Deng Songbai, Luo Hailong, attending physicians Liu Qi and Rao Maohua, all originated from the second affiliated hospital of Chongqing Medical University. The second affiliated hospital of Chongqing Medical University is the national tertiary hospital integrating medical treatment, teaching, scientific research, prevention, health care, and foreign-related medical care. The hospital currently has two campuses with 2,580 beds and a maximum open bed capacity of nearly 4,000. In 2023, the outpatient volume was 2.364 million visits with 152,000 discharged patients and 65,000 surgeries performed. As a foreign-related hospital, patients not only come from all over the country, but also from the United States, Australia, Japan, and other countries. Hello, I'm Ao Meng, the captain of the 7th China Medical Team to Barbados. I hold a PhD 
and I am a accomplished associate professor and master's supervisor within the Department of Ultrasound at the second affiliated hospital of Chongqing Medical University. I'm delighted to follow the footsteps of Dr. Sun Yang and Zhang Xunxia, becoming the third ultrasound physician to join this mission. In July this year, Dr. Fields from QEH joins us to study in our department. Our department is one of the earliest ultrasound departments established in southwest China. Our department has six subspecialty groups, including abdominal group, superficial organ, interventional group, cardiac group, pediatric group, vascular group, and musculoskeletal group. I work as the leader of a vascular group. My research mainly focuses on the ultrasonic diagnosis and treatment of cardiovascular diseases and the diagnosis and treatment of interventional ultrasound. I have extensive experience in diagnosing of cardiovascular diseases, especially in vascular. Pilates is my go-to for a workout. It's like a soothing balm for the body and the soul. Plus, I've got these two little angels in my life, a son and a daughter, who are as spirited and joyful as they come, adding a whole lot of love to my days. I can tell you how excited I am about our team's upcoming trip to this gorgeous country. We are all set to bring our medical know-how and share it with you all. And we are really looking forward to chatting with you, learning together, and moving forward on this journey. I'm Dan Songbai, a cardiologist in the Department of Cardiovascular Medicine. My specific area of expertise lies in for coronary artery interventional treatments. I scale in interventional therapies for left main coronary artery, complex bifurcations, severe calcifications, and chronic total occurrence, particularly those guided by intravascular imaging modalities. Work is important, but there is nothing like hitting the road with my family to make life sweet. My daughter has got a soft spot for creatures and we've got this adorable cat that is a heart and soul our home. I'm genuinely excited about setting food in Barbados. I can't wait to team up, share ideas, and get to know you better. Hello, I'm Dr. Luo Hailong. I'm a vascular surgeon. Our department is among the pioneers in vascular surgery in China. My expertise lies in both open and endovascular procedures, including minimally invasive treatments for varicose veins, interventional therapies for deep venous thrombosis, and vascular treatments for diabetic foods and peripheral vascular bypass surgeries. I'm a firm believer that a strong body and a sharp mind are the best teammates. Being chosen for the medical team heading to Barbados, it's a real honor. I'm stoked to pack my bags with all the knowledge I've got and bring it to the beautiful shores of Barbados. I'm ready to roll up my sleeves and deliver the kind of medical care that makes a real difference to the people there. Greetings everyone, my name is Liu Qi. I am an anesthesiologist. I am proficient in independently administering anesthesia of complex cases involving ASA grade 3 and 4 patients. Additionally, I specialize in performing canis gastrointestinal endoscopy anesthesia. Besides the clinic work, I also have a teaching job at the Second Clinical College of Chongqing Medical University. I love what I do, and I put my heart into helping them grasp the ins and outs of clinical anesthesia. And I've got to say, being part of the 7th China medical team heading to Barbados is a real honor. 
I'm ready to share my skills and knowledge to ensure we deliver top-notch care to the people of Barbados. Hello, everyone. I'm Zhao Maohua. I'm attending nuclear medicine physician from the second affiliated hospital of Chongqing Medical University. My department has a history of 48 years and currently has 38 employees. We focus on dealing with thyroid problems, tumor, cardiovascular, and other diseases. Using radioactive isotopes for accurate diagnosis and effective treatment. My department has complete facilities, including PET CT, SPED CT, radio nuclide wards, and laboratory. Every year, we carry out around 12,000 nuclear invasion procedures and about 1,000 nuclear treatments. I've been pretty in my research journey, published six essay papers, co-authored four books. Being part of the seven Chinese medical teams heading to Barbados is a badge of honor for me. I'm looking forward to lending my expertise to boost the development of nuclear medicine in Barbados and to work my heart out to offer the best medical care to the locals. Hello, my name is Yuan Ye, and I am an attending physician in the Department of Acupuncture and Moxibustion of Chongqing Traditional Chinese Medicine Hospital. Our hospital was founded in 1902 as the Hall of Bernovenance by the French Catholic Franciscan Missionaries of Mary. Our hospital has now become the largest tertiary traditional Chinese medicine hospital in Chongqing. My department of acupuncture and moxibustion is a national key clinical specialty. We take stroke hemiplegia, paralysis, insomnia, as the advantageous types of diseases. I have systematically studied TCM and medicine courses, as well as specialized knowledge of acupuncture and massage. And with my extensive clinical experience, I am able to independently manage a wide range of diseases, including pain and neurological disorders. I have also developed a method of acupuncture treatment based on the principle of reciprocal inhibition, which combines acupuncture with muscle kinesiology to effectively promote the recovery of limb muscle strength and prevent abnormal elevation of muscle tone, especially for patients with muscular dystonia. In the coming year, I will dedicate myself to promote the promotion of traditional Chinese medicine and enhance the application and influence of Chinese acupuncture and increase the friendship between the people of China and Barbados. Hello, I'm Dr. Gao Jianya from the Chongqing University Three Gorges Hospital. Our hospital consists of a main campus and four branch campuses. It is a leader in cultural hospital construction and a pioneer in hospital guzhou development in China. As a provincial regional medical center, we serve a population of 23 meaning across 23 districts and counties. I'm a nephrologist and our department serves as the quality control center for kidney disease in the northern eastern Chongqing region. Annually, our department manages over 13,000 outpatient visits and more than 2,000 inpatient admissions. Along with over 17,000 routine dialysis sessions, I'm part of the vascular access team involved in the creation and maintenance of arterial venous fistulas. My research focuses on the impact of vascular smooth muscle cell dysfunction on AVF and I have published four SCI papers. In my free time, I enjoy calligraphy and fishing, 
writing with calligraphy brush. It's my way of fighting inner peace. Out on the water with my fishing rod, I get to soak up some of the nature's serenity. My wife, who is a general practitioner, keeps our home in tip-top shape, and we often enjoy relaxing afternoons together. I'm absolutely thrilled to be joined in the servant Chinese medical team handing to Barbados. It's not every day you get a chance like this. One that's not just about swapping professional insights, but also about connecting on a deeper level, sharing our cultures and daily lives with friends from across the globe. I've got a feeling this is going to be one of those experiences that sticks with me for a lifetime. Hello everyone, I'm Kuang An Di, a supervisor nurse from the Leolito Intensive Care Unit of the Children's Hospital of Chongqing Medical University. The hospital is a national tertiary comprehensive children's hospital that integrates medical treatment, teaching, and scientific research. It ranks third among all children's hospitals in China with a total of 2,480 beds. Within our hospital, the Leolitology department currently has three wards and 330 inpatient beds. I have been working in the Leolito Intensive Care Unit for nine years. I excel in the treatment and the refined care of ultra-small infants, as well as respiratory management of critically ill newborns, etc. In addition, as a Leolito specialist nurse training teacher, I have taught several sessions of specialist nurses ever since the third batch of medical teams touched down in Barbados. My department has been right there with you, side by side. Now, it's my turn, and I'm feeling the honor of stepping up as part of the 7th China medical team to Barbados. Our job is more than just the medical staff. It's about bridging cultures, forging friendships, and that makes all the hard work worthwhile. I'm looking forward to the year ahead, hoping to sprinkle a bit of love and hope wherever I go. Barbados, see you soon!